Good morning. Welcome, Beverly. There we go. <laughs> is is me Mr. 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 It's me and it's Dan. It's him and and Dan. Uh, me. Mal's not here. Anyway, um, no. I'm I'm still I'm I'm still making Dan's breakfast. Yeah, so. sorry. Uh, Dan, you just uh, deal with it. Okay. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome to Breakfast Dream. Um. Yeah, guys, I made it. I usually wake up late, so this is. New. This is new for me. I forgot to tell Steven that I actually was coming. Uh, it was fine. But it's... <laughs> sorry. Yeah, um, I, um... I wasn't sure if you were coming or not. Because at, like, 8.48, I was like, Oh, I guess he's not coming. Oh, yeah, sorry. And I started to change the setup, and all of a sudden it was like, ding dong! And I was like, oh, never mind. Yeah, I'm, um... Yeah. I made my breakfast. I'm just getting... I'm getting yours ready. Okay. Thanks, buddy. No problem. I haven't eaten... Like, in a long time. La. Uh, no, no Toad Link, I, I didn't just show up, uh, <laughs> it's just, um, I, I, I kind of like half jokingly was like, hey, y'all need people? And then Steven was like, yeah, buddy, just head over. And then I got a message from Mal last night that was like, Dan, Steven said, come over if you want. And I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, I was, I was not kidding. I, I, I wasn't sure if you were just saying it just for the, <laughs> you know. For the joke? Yeah. No, uh, I, I was for real. So, hi everybody. Dan, what time did you wake up? Um. Because I got up at four. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, you didn't go to sleep once you dropped off now at the airport? Nope. Oh. I've been up since four. Um, I've I five hours. I I woke up at like seven fifty. I I was actually I was actually considering going to um uh the the Jangies. Oh really? Yeah, but well, it 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 would have taken a while, and plus I. It took me longer to get ready than I thought, so. I will be done with this in like one second. Okay. Um, I, uh, I need tea, says uh, Steven, you need to sleep? No, I'm good. <laughs> um, looking good. Dan sounds like he could do a good impression of Dr. Nick from The Simpsons. I don't know who that is. <laughs> I I actually never... The only episode that I've ever seen of The Simpsons is uh, The Monorail, which uh, Conan O'Brien said was the um, his favorite episode that he worked on as far as writing. Thanks, buddy. No problem. I'm coming to sit down. Um... So yeah, that's the only episode I ever saw. Are you a big Simpsons fan? I've seen very, very, very few episodes of The Simpsons. It was a thing that like Mal grew up watching, and not really me. So I don't have a whole lot of experience with the show. That happens, and it scares me. Sorry, do you what, need a place to is, put your... What is that? What is what? There are not raisins in our toast today. <laughs> but there's cinnamon in Dan's. Yep. Dan, Dan wanted cinnamon toast, so I made him some cinnamon toast. Thanks, buddy. No problem. Oh. There we, there we go. Oh, everybody's gonna vomit now. A little bit. 
but it's not too bad. All right. That looks, it's hard to tell because it's tiny. Is that looking focused to everybody? It looks pretty in focus to me. No. I'm, you know, it's a, it's a tiny thing on the screen. If I do this, normally I do all this before, but Dan got here really late. Hi. I get to just play Dan for this. Sorry, everybody. There we go. That's perfect. Okay. Mm. I'm gonna skip the opera for the morning. All right. Now we're set. If you're just joining us, and you're like, right. and you're like, where, where's, where's Mal? Um, Mal uh, had to go. I, I, I got cursed by a wizard, and I got turned into Dan. <laughs> That's what happened. <laughs> That's definitely it. Uh, Mal, <laughs> even though we just got back from Japan. Mal already had a, a planned trip yeah. to go to Wisconsin because her grandma is turning um, 90, which is really old, um, and she doesn't seem 90 at all. Oh. Like it's she's she's incredible, man. Like for being 90, that's nuts. She's she acts like she's not even 60. So yeah, she's uh, she's in great shape. But uh, Mao, they're they're the whole family's throwing like this giant party, and um, Mao is going up there. So that's where Mao is. So instead, Dan is joining us today. Hi. So Dan's uh, Dan's over here. Uh, I, I had to take Mao to the airport. Uh, she had to be there. Her flight was at six, so I I, I got her there at like five ish. So I got up at four, and I've just been up. And actually, fun fact. So fun, the funnest fact. Well, I haven't eaten since yesterday at noon. At lunch bunch. Cause I, I've been suffering from jet lag real bad. I don't know how you've been doing. Yeah, it's been, it's been real bad. I, I, um, I almost napped yesterday afternoon, but didn't. It was so freaking hard. Mal napped, which I, I think was a mistake, but. Yeah, I. <sighs> It's been so hard. I, I think that's probably why. Because I actually woke up with a like an eye migraine. Um, but I took some Advil and I'm fine now. But well, that's good. Yeah, it. I don't know, man. It's it's really. I mean, I've I've been to Japan it's... and I it was not this bad before. I don't know why it's hurting so bad this this time, but yeah, yeah. But yeah, I um we had lunch munch yesterday, so I ate at noon. And then I came home and just worked on stuff. And then it was around breakfast. eight. Breakfast. Breakfast. It was around breakfast. Uh, it was around eight p.m. And like I, I couldn't do it anymore. I was like I was so exhausted. And we hadn't eaten dinner yet. And I told him, I was like I'm sorry. I cannot stay awake. I, I have to sleep. And she was like okay. So I went to bed last night at eight and slept until four. So I I got eight hours of sleep. I woke up at four. And uh, I haven't eaten anything, so I should probably eat this bread. Yeah, you, you eat that. Um, I love bread. Mm. Said Oprah to her audience. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> and then a truck backed in full of bread. She Everybody. said, normally everyone will get bread. But today, this bread is mine. The lights dimmed, and the music <laughs> in the studio stopped. Oprah tore open the back of the truck and started to eat the bread. She didn't bother to open the plastic wrapping around the bread. She just ate through it. I get a bread, and I get a bread. <laughs> the audience gasped in horror as they watched Oprah consume all of the bread. When she was done, she went back to the middle of the platform and sat down in her chair. She said, that was good bread. I am Oprah. The truck that had backed into the studio <laughs> <laughs> said, I got places to be. 
and floored it at 16 miles an hour out of the studio. <laughs> Welcome to breakfast stream. I hope this is someone's first breakfast stream. And they're like, what's <laughs> happening? I'm scared. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> uh, let me read some of the things that have happened. Yay! Um, that 16 bits, 16, 16, 16 bits, 1600, 16 alert was from Mike Bliss 218. Good morning, Stephen and Dan. I get a haircut and a new iPad case, and you don't have enough bits for haircut alert. And where's Kepler and Sagan? Well, first off, thank you for the bits. Appreciate that. Uh, Kepler and Sagan, actually, because I've been up all day, um, they are exhausted. I fed them already. And normally they'd be like, oh, feed us and we won't be on you. And they're like, no. They've been up for five hours because we've been up for five hours. Well, so they're they're in the other room just conked. They're just out. Oh. Okay. I don't know. We might see them before the end of the stream if they if they come in here, but I'm not not entirely entirely sure. Before that, we had a thousand bits from uh, Moltac thirty two. Thank you, Moltac. Yay! That's a great name. Reminds me of Moltar. You know who Moltar is? Um, is that is he, is he from um? Is that the Taco Bell alert? <laughs> I haven't heard that in so long! <laughs> Yay! You know what's hilarious? Huh. Uh, Lindsay actually was, um, she had to go to a meeting last night for the, for the Turtle Club. Mm hmm Or the Turtle, the organization. The, tur the Turtle Club. <laughs> Am I totally enough for the Turtle Club? And she, and, and, and she was near Taco Bell, and so she was like, hey, you want some Taco Bell? And you said... So for the first time in, like... Six months at least, or like a while. We had, yeah, we had uh, Taco Bell. So, okay, let me ask her. That that might have actually attributed to the headache I had this morning, but I mean, I, I think know. it's I think it's a well known science fact that Taco Bell causes various things to happen to your body that you don't, yeah, want. Um. It just starts happening. Anyway, thank you. Um, thank. <laughs> I almost said thank you, Moltar. Thank you, oh, yeah. Moltar. Yeah, for sorry. the for the one thousand bit. Did, that's from uh, Space Ghost. Did you ever watch Space Ghost? Um, no. I, I watched the episodes where they had Aqua Teen in it, or that one. I didn't know that was a thing. Yeah, they um, they were actually invented for an episode of um. Oh. That. Yeah. That's neat. Yeah. I I used to watch Space Ghost like back. A million years ago. Oh and, really? Yeah, I was. The comedy hit me in a good way, and I was really young for it. But I was like, "This is fun. I like this." Oh, I thought you were gonna say the the humor went over my head because I was like, maybe some of it. I don't know. Yeah. I, I don't remember when it came out exactly, but I was yeah. young. I remember watching it and being like, "Yeah, this is cool." Yeah. Anyway, uh, the Taco yeah. Bell alert came from Skylot 1963. Thanks. 19 <laughs> Skylot 1963 sent 1962 bits. Yeah. It said 1962 and 1963 were both a long time ago. It's true. 1962 was slightly longer. Sure was. But not by much. Like, 12 yeah. months at most. Yep. At least, probably. At least. <laughs> Maybe 14. <laughs> as, 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 I, as I recall, 1962 was a longer year. Yep, like, uh-huh. Yeah, that, that was the, uh, the, the year of the um, space-time continuum. Uh, oh, yeah, 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 that was it. Oh, Tom! Fo Tom Fox is here. Apparently, Good morning, Tom. Hope you're hope you're doing well. Hope you're. Uh, top, top of the morning. Top tap top, top of the morning. Peggy. Yeah. Oh Lord, we just finished our our Taco Bell alert from Skylot. Now now we've got a Peggy alert from Dishnet. Yeah. It's twenty thirty three bits. Peggy sees old friend Dan. Woo. <laughs> well, that's not the most horrifying thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Dude, I I'm I'm so glad that I could help y'all this this past year. I am too. <laughs> with, with, well, I mean, like like not only to you know help, uh, but you could that yeah, you got to experience all of the jokes firsthand live. Yeah, 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 in person and. Peggy, that that that's I, I feel like that was definitely. I mean, besides us getting to the like like pass surpassing our our uh, our, our goal. goal the second best thing was it was Peggy. Peggy. Peggy, um, I'm gonna be honest. When when, when people were donating towards a game <laughs> called Amazing horrifying. Island, 
Like, was... there, there was not any part of me that thought that, you know, six months down the road, it would still be, like, a very relevant part of channel lore. Yeah. But here we are. Yep. You never know. You never know what's going to happen. Anyway, Dishnet, thank you so much for, uh, for summoning Peggy to witness her old friend Dan. Yay. Oh, Peggy. A frightening thing. And Fossex threw a uh, gift sub towards uh, Tom Fox. That was nice. Thanks, Fossex. And uh, I'm, I'm still behind some of these. Let me scroll back up. We also uh, we also had, as I choke on this bread because I haven't eaten in it so long, uh, 1,400 bits from Skylot, uh, who said, 1,400 for Dan! Yay, for me! I'm glad that you're here today, Dan. Oh, thanks, buddy. Because, for one, I... I, I, mean, I mean, I definitely you invited done... myself over, <laughs> but... It's better with two people. It's better with two people. Oh, Tom, oh, hold on. Let's just scroll up. Tom said, I have a flight to Chicago this morning. However, I'd like to be up this early normally. Oh, you, um, you're going to be in the air when Mal's in the air, maybe. Oh. I don't know when your flight is. Mal's, Mal's not here because she, she is currently, right now this second, in the air between Charlotte and Milwaukee because she's on her way to Milwaukee. So. Oh, nice. She's heading up that way. Tom, are you going to um, uh, Versus Expo? Is that where you're headed? I know a lot of people are going to Versus Expo, which is in Chicago, unless I forgot where it is. He's, he's going to be here for the uh, thing you do, right? He's going to be here for Coliseum, yeah. Yeah. So I wasn't sure if he was going to uh, Versus Expo. The reason I'm not at Versus Expo is because I knew that it was going to be real close to Japan, and I was like, I'll probably be a little jet lagged. Yeah. Little did I know it was going to be a, a million times worse. And uh, if I was there, I'd probably fall asleep into, like, Tyler's arms or something. And he'd be like, I don't know what to do with you. You're <laughs> like, no, I'm falling asleep anywhere. You, you, you can you can, you can can redo the Josh hug that you did when you first met. Except I will be completely incapacitated. Tom says, yeah, and the thing you do. Yeah, TRG, uh, it's been announced now, so we can talk about it. But TRG Coliseum. So... Yeah, Tom will, Tom will be here for that. That's in, that's, uh, oh man. I was like, that's a, oh, man, I can't talk about that yet. Jeez. What? I was gonna talk about the, the location, but I can't talk about the location. It hasn't been revealed oh. where it is. Well, so, maybe it shouldn't be, so then people don't I show mean, up. I mean, well, I mean, it's not like we're gonna, like, here's the address. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, but it, you know, it's, it's one of those weird situations. Like, oh, I can't even talk about where it is. Oh. Huh. Well. Okay. Whoops. Guess I'll wait. <laughs> Talk about it at some point. Anyway. Yep. Thank you, Skylot, for those bits. Also, 600 bits from Hotex Page, who just says, boo. Ah! Hotex, you're scaring Dan. Dan is horrified. I'm scared. I'm so scared I'm drinking. I'm drinking grape. I'm drinking grape. I'm gonna drink all this purple. <laughs> I'm gonna drink all this Sprite. Thomas says, Dan, tell us about your shirt. Mm. Um, so oh, this is... yeah, I was like, what what shirt? And I looked over, I was like, it's just gray. I'm like, Thomas, it's just a gray it's shirt. It's just gray, but it's got a little chain chop, chain, chain chop. Chim, 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 chim. Chim, yeah. chim chop. Um, it's, uh, oh. it's, yep. um, the, uh, I got like, I think it was like six or seven shirts in Japan. Well, Uniqlo um, has them so cheap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, they're like ten bucks. And so they they have they had a whole series of Mario shirts. Um, and which uh, I, I think they kind of regularly do. Oh really? Mm hmm. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I got one where like on the on the pocket there's um some booze not not drinks alcohol just like but, a, an entire but, six pack of miller light and i was like yeah i love that miller light <laughs> no daddy um, ice sign me up um boo, like boo scary boo ghost scary, scary boo ghost which is uh, the full, full well, well, official well they're not name. scary they're both shy and they're both like looking uh ah yeah but um and then there's like another one that has bullet bills on it. Um, and then there's like two or three other ones that like, they're, they're both also 
they're all pocket shirts, but they have mm -hmm. like other just random other different designs that I really like. So this is um this is from Uniqlo, yeah. which are not unique to Japan. Yeah, they're they're unique to sixteen different places. Yeah, Japan. Uh huh. United States. The sixteen thing is new to me. Is it? Yeah. Is you it actually bit, you is should, it been you on the channel it. a lot? Oh. I mean, do you know what it's in reference to? Uh. Uh, it's from Extra Life. It is? Yeah. Oh! Now yep. you get it. Yeah, yep. it's Mary uh -huh. Kate Nashley Sweet 16. Oh, gosh. By the way, that was 1600 bits from Chemist 2020, who says, here are the rest of the bits I bought this month. All I have to say is, 16! Good job, man. I'm actually, you know, it's weird. I'm not as hungry as I thought I would be. Well, I should definitely eat. Yeah, you should eat. But I just, you know, at least finish that. that first well, yeah, place. I'm working on it. I just, okay. I feel like I like it's been almost 24 hours. I feel like you should be hungry. Uh, oh, I like did. 18. I did. I did though. Maybe 20. I did. I should clarify. After I dropped Mal off, I went to Donut Man. Oh, well then that's eating something. Well, I mean, it was it was a single donut, but what, it was food. Yes. What what kind of uh, vanilla cream. D donut, did you eat? Vanilla cream. Is is that just um, it's Boston cream? No. A Boston cream is called a Boston cream. What's a vanilla cream? It's it's a donut filled with vanilla cream. Not vanilla pudding? Correct. That would be... What is vanilla cream? Like... Vanilla cream like is... Like half and half cream? Like What? I no. <laughs> it's like busting at the seams. It's like, mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Skim milk, perfect. Milk no, it's milk it's, it's, it's 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 like icing. It's like cake icing. Oh. See, that's how Mal see, feels about it. See, see, like I don't understand, because because what's okay? There's Boston cream, and then there's the other one that you like, which is abomination. Uh, it's like eating cake. Uh, Who wouldn't want cake? Uh, it's delicious. Okay, so sorry. Okay, you got, so you, you, got you got like you got like a donut. It can have white icing, you know, like uh, buttercream icing. That's okay. a vanilla cream. It can have like a pudding custard thing, which is the consistency of a Boston cream, right? Well, well like Boston an eclair. cream is like pudding. Not yeah, pudding. It's a, yeah, I know, but I'm saying it's different. I'm saying there's icing. Oh yeah, 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 yep. Yeah. And then there's also ones that are more like whipped cream. And I don't know what that's called, honestly. Um, a mistake. A mistake. Like, I'm, I don't <laughs> like whipped, I really don't like whipped cream. That's yeah, not my yeah, jam. Yeah. And there's been times where I have bought a donut thinking it was an, a vanilla cream, and it was not a vanilla cream. It was like whipped cream. And I was like, nah, I'm like, not like, into that. Like, like even when you're at like a New Year's party and they have like those... Um, it's a weird scenario, but okay. I'm following. <laughs> where it's the only places where I've actually had these things, but they're like... Cream, whipped cream? Cream puffs. Oh, oh, like eclairs? Yeah. that's Because that's the same kind, right? You only have eaten eclairs at New Year's parties? Yeah. I don't there, even think that's a there, thing. There, there, there was a New Year's party that I went to. I was like in high school. I was probably like a freshman, and I ate so many of those that I got. I was sick by the time that it was midnight. So I was on the couch while everybody else was celebrating because I was, I was sick. It was a good New Year's. I don't. I mean, I don't know, but I don't think that eclairs are like oh, with a New Year's treat. Like yeah, when you're yeah, in San Francisco, like you gotta eat rice. It's not like a New if Year's it's tradition. New Year's, you gotta eat eclair. I don't. I mean, that's that's neat. I like. I, I I can do eclairs. I can do eclairs. I'm not a huge fan of the pudding custard consistency. I can do them on occasion. I, I really like them if they're just like a little frozen. So there's a little like they're oh, a little yeah, chilled. Yeah, yeah. I um that's fine. But um I don't I don't care much for. The whipped cream consistency in a donut, or anywhere in my life. So, Dom says cannolis are delicious, and Tom is right. Good God, cannolis are good. 
and the best place to get them, I, I don't know where the best place to get them, but a good place to get them. <laughs> I just realized I was speaking too close. I was like, I don't really know. It's probably like Italy. Um, Boston, Boston. There's some places in Boston in like the little Italy section where you can get some crazy good cannolis. New York City too. I got some in New York City and oh Lord have mercy, they're good. You know what you so should, good. you know what else you can get in Boston? Probably nearly anything. Boston cream? <laughs> Dunkin' best, Donuts? The best donuts. Anyway, that all that entire conversation. Hey, the best donut, hey. That entire right. conversation was courtesy of Chemist 2020 1600 bits. That's how that all got started. Thank Thanks. you, Chemist 2020. Sorry for de derailing this entire It's stream. all right. It's going to happen. Uh, I'm going to continue scrolling backwards and hitting up some alerts that were from a bit ago. 1600 bits came from Dark Giant 626 who says, Today is my birthday and I'm 16 years old. Oh, snap. Happy birthday. Go, go drive a car th through a mall. <laughs> wow. What a great way... <laughs> What a great way to start your, your 16th birthday is to be arrested um, for a long time, um, put in juvie, and never drive again. And when they, when they arrest you, just say, I was trying to recreate the scene from the Blues Brothers. I just thought that would be a good birthday gift to myself. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just... Uh, I'm a hard disagree with Dan you're, you're, on this you're gonna one. You're going to steer clear from I'm that. steer clear that one it seems like uh maybe don't do that but uh <laughs> i won't dan well good thanks for not listening to me i mean don't get me wrong <laughs> how fun would that be oh, not to like not it, to like endanger oh, no, 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 no. everyone yeah, but yeah, just yeah. like the act of driving through a mall well well, well the the great thing about malls uh, like it, yeah. at, le at least inside malls yeah. or like interior malls is that most of them are empty anyway so you're, you're you're really doing them a favor <laughs> no 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 i mean i mean you're you're definitely less likely to uh hit a uh human being um tom brought up the old uh folgers ad when they were doing that that weird when they had that weird few months <laughs> the best part of waking up is driving a car through a mall <laughs> it was a really <laughs> weird time in their in their life and it did it showed the person like recklessly driving through the mall and then there was a close up into the car and he was driving but holding a cup of coffee. And it was like, Folgers, wake up to recklessness. Uh, anyway, uh, Dark Giant, I hope your birthday's great. Um, I hope that, uh, I hope you don't get arrested on your birthday. Um, for one, because that would be a terrible birthday, but then also I hope you don't get arrested at 16. That's just too young. To get, yep. I, well, I guess if you're gonna get arrested, do it before you're 18. Yeah, and then, and then and then it means a little less. But, but also, it, don't but just don't. It, yeah, but then it probably just, just like lowers your chance of like getting into like. Yeah, I, I'm sure that there are some doors if, that probably if you plan close. to go to college or like. You yeah, plan I mean to it's not impossible, job. but like it. Yeah, I think things would get a little more difficult. Or so plan I'm, to get alone. Yeah, I would say um, the best thing to do on your 16th birthday is probably you know just do something for fun for you that doesn't involve uh, recklessly driving through them all. Anyway, happy birthday. Remember, kids, if you want to get arrested, do it early. <laughs> um, uh, we also had 500 bits from Murmur who says, Bits for Dan! Yay! Lots of people doing bits for Dan. People are happy you're here. Yay! I, I'm, I'm not going to say that that's because <laughs> people are, like, excited mouse gone. It's, sure, it's not that. It's just, you know. Dan, have you ever been on a breakfast stream, like, just... Um, just us? I, uh, no, I, I, was, I was there for the first Japan one. But that was the three of us. Have you not been on one prior? We did one at Chefcon. Uh, you were probably here for. I. Yeah, so. but but I. Th this is definitely the first one that uh, oh, was just me and you. Um, yeah. I mean, people probably don't know, but like, we have a long history of doing live shows what? together. If I say it like that, it sounds like we're both cam oh, girls yeah. on the weekend. That's oh, not you, what I intend. You, do you remember Sandstorm? <laughs> That's what I was getting at. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, it was like soft, sophomore year. A long time ago. This was 2008. Yeah. 2008. Dan and I hosted a live show. On Ustream? On, right? was it Ustream? I think it was Ustream. Twitch yeah. didn't exist. Yep. Uh, long before Twitch. Me and Dan hosted a show. 
once a week and we ended up doing it for I think like eight to ten weeks something like that yeah because there's like there's a, a fair good number of shows and it was just like a half hour show of just weird nothing yeah I don't re really remember what we did we yeah we, we would we would dance to sandstorm and like that's there was definitely the rude yep um it wasn't really a it wasn't really a show. No, and honestly, it, 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 now it had, thinking it had back, very like, little structure, if any at all. Thinking back, I realized that Breakfast Stream is not that much removed from what we did. <laughs> it's like a, it's only like a semblance of an idea. We, we, we can't play Sandstorm on Twitch, can we? We can't. Oh, we okay. can't. Um, which is a shame. There was also I remember there was a segment that. We because we ran did, it through. Um, did we do like improv or something, or was it probably? Uh, I don't know. What were you gonna say? Sorry. I was gonna say that I remember there was a segment where like for one minute straight because we were running the the whole thing through Cam Twist, which at the time was like mind blowing. You could do all these video oh, effects. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there was one that would like condense it all to a, a 3D cube. Oh yeah, yeah. And yeah. it would just bounce around like a Windows screensaver. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we would, and, that's when, I think that's when we and, would play Sandstorm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, and there was an effect also where you could change the hue, and so it would just, like, rainbow hue over time. Yeah. Um, yeah, and we would we would just, like, do weird... And that, like, that was, like, a minute... Yeah. Minute-long segment that appeared every week. Yeah, and I think it was, like, towards the end, probably. And, the, I mean, the thing is, back like, then... You, you can't do that at the beginning, because then, the like, you can't beat that, so... <laughs> <laughs> can't start with that you can't yeah. end with that yeah yeah it was that it's so weird to think back to all that but yeah that happened that was uh 2000 it was 2008 wow um and we we would just do the show and just post the link on like facebook for our friends and you know yeah a few people would watch like three didn't, didn't we also like post about it on um, starman.net or something or? probably yeah yeah i'm glad to know that there's an actual sandstorm emote Oh wow! If it, if if Twitch had been around back then, and emotes had been around, oh, that would have been yeah. what yeah. everyone posted during that segment. You know what I should do? I should like find like a, a royalty free like very oh, it sounds yeah, yeah. very close to Sandstorm, like, but it's some it's just yeah, wrong. Like a, like a MIDI. Yeah. Yeah. There, there's like a few notes that you're yeah. like, hmm? that's not right. And then and then recreate that. Where yeah. we float around like a window screensaver, and then that's the. Yeah. It wasn't a great show. <laughs> Chaz is here, I think. Yeah, he's here. Hey, Chazzy. Chaz is here. Uh, anyway, I'm getting through this toast, it's taking a little bit. Yeah. Chaz I... said he overslept. Chaz said he hasn't gotten to press the button in so long. I'm getting to it. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I'm getting to it. We had um, 666 bits from Generic Juice Box. What did Mal do to make the wizard turn her into Dan? Um, Probably piss him off. I, that's yeah, the only way. I, 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 um, what I actually ended up doing was driving a car through a mall. That's what, that's what turned me into Dan. It can happen to you, too. Yep. If you drive a car through a mall, you will turn into Dan. Uh-huh. I can only assume that that's what happened to Jake and Elwood later in the film. And they had to find a, a different wizard to turn them back before they could keep filming. Uh -huh. you know, anyway, I, I love I love painting and. Um, uh, Hi, I'm Mao, and I love painting. Welcome to <laughs> Mao Creates. Today we're going to be painting a lake or a tree or something. Here it is. Well, bye. <laughs> She's gonna see this and just be oh, mad. Man. Yeah, she's gonna hate me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, thank you, Generic Juice Box, for those bits. We also had uh, 100 bits from uh, Casual Shadow JR. Thank you, Casual Shadow. 245 from uh, 05 Nataku. Next year's April. Keep doing what you guys do. You guys are awesome. Sending something special come June. Ooh. Burr, burr, burr. <laughs> I will stay on the lookout. We got a, we got a lot of mail. Uh, we. As soon as Mal gets back, we have to record March Mail. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff here. We'll is get there, is that all from March? 
Um, some of it's probably from April, but very okay. little. Most of it's March. Wow. There's a lot. There's a lot of stuff we gotta get open. Thank you, Nataku. Appreciate it. Also got 100 bits from Mike Bliss, 218. Uh, thank you, Mike. Um, and then uh, there's there's a lot of sub stuff. I'm gonna just very quickly get through these. Uh, we had subs from Jabberman29, Harm, NTG, Vinny G plays Dudamoos, Mr. Incredible Noob Lord hits seven months. Seven's my lucky number, yay, for seven months. Have either of you played Joker yet? If so, thoughts. Oh, did you hear about all that? Joker? The, the fighter DLC, uh, Joker's out? Uh, no. Uh... It was real sudden. It kind of was upsetting, because, like, it was the day before, late at night, and Nintendo was like, Joker's coming out tomorrow, and here's a 15-minute video that talks about a huge update. Okay, bye. Oh. Normally they're like, that, that, that was like Nintendo wild. Direct coming, Smash Direct coming, get ready about all these things. And you're yeah. like, oh man, I have two days to hyperventilate. And instead they're like, oh, here. Oh, here it is. And I'm like, it's, what it's are you tomorrow. doing? So, it's, um. It's like what Bethesda did with, um, oh, Fallout Shelter. Um, it's out. <laughs> here you go. Here you go. So you have another. Uh -oh. Did you get the Fighter Pass or no? No. I, um, I haven't played, but 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 it, I yeah. did I did get the um, Planty Boy. Oh yeah, but that's so. As the chat saying, one of the big things stage builder is stage builder, and that's free. That's built. It's into the update. Oh okay. So if you've ever dreamed of just playing lots of stages that are in the shapes of various genitalia, your dreams can certainly come true thanks to stage builder. It's like brawl all over again. Yeah. Uh huh. But but much better. Like the can, the stuff you, that you can do is actually pretty cool. Is is there like a community area yep. where you can down? Okay, that's cool. Yep. So it's not just like oh my crappy stages I made. Yeah, you can actually like download stuff and um, the tools that you can make stuff is is more advanced than brawl. And um, yeah, I mean it's just it's really it's a good update. There's <laughs> there's software to prevent you from making genitalia. Darn. It, it scans it and says, mm, I'll make it real obscure. Too, too phallic. Remove. Delete. Ban account. Uh, I got three months up from Haliloth. A plus already. I'm glad I have an alarm set to remind me breakfast stream. Best way to start today. Thank you, Haliloth. Hey. Seven months from Andy. Oh, and five. It's my seven month, and it's right before I catch my flight to San Antonio, Texas. Everybody flying today. Yeah. Good luck in the air. Not that... You can really affect it. Help, help the, yeah, it. yeah. I hope you don't get sick. That's a thing that you can like have some level of control over. Yeah, sure. Like you don't want to go to Taco Bell like right before a flight. That would be Coffee. rude to you and to everyone around you. <laughs> that was uh, 495, 495 bits from Mike Bliss. He says, Stephen, check hey. out Twitch channel Lombard Bros Gaming after the stream if you're interested. Also, here's your weekly call fee. Well, thank you for the call fee. After oh, after the stream, I'm probably not going to be checking out much other than my computer because I'm editing the Japan vlogs. Oh, yeah. 4-1 is done. April 1st. Oh, nice. It's definitely coming out today. And honestly, I've started I, I'm, I've started working on 4-2, and it might also be out today. Oh. I'm not sure yet. Oh. I got I to, gotta, like, make sure. But it, it seems reasonable right now that you could get both April 1st and 2nd today. Um, but first, for sure. So I'm gonna I'm gonna just continually be. And that's not an April Fool's thing. That's a. It, I mean, it's well, like well, April well, 18th is, but or I mean, something. <laughs> well, I mean that it's coming out today. Yeah, there is a little. There's a, there's oh, a little. Yeah, yeah. There's a. Sound. There's a little tiny joke in April first. Yeah. Kind of. It's a bit of a joke. But some people probably won't even know if it's a joke. They'll be like, "What? That was dumb." I'll be like. Mm. It's fine. Just be like, it was Chaz's idea. Yeah, if you didn't like it, it was Chaz's idea. If you like it, it was still Chaz's idea. But um, hopefully you'll... It's just, it's just a little tiny minor thing. We didn't have time. I mean, in years past, we've done, like, actual, like, April Fool's yeah. things on both Steven Plays and Steven Vlog. And this year was just it, too crazy. Could not, could not do. So maybe next year there will be another, like... Uncle Steven's Egg Collect. Because that was fun. We could do a multiplayer version. We could make everyone sick. Oh, yay. Wait, what do you mean everybody's sick? Everyone has to eat eggs, oh, 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 the oh. M&Ms out of the but, eggs. But, but then we have to have like 3,000 eggs. <laughs> we don't need 3,000 eggs. We just need like 3,000 M&Ms. Oh. 
Anyway, Ianthe Silverfire, seven months. Thank you, Ianthe. Seven months also to Skylot. The stars have aligned and I'm able to watch from work. I'm not going to question it. I'm just going to encourage it. Uh, Rian, 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 uh, 74 resubscribes for seven months. Seven months, woo, and hey, Dan, how are you doing today? I'm doing... Rian. Well, good. Perfect. Also, what is that frightening music? Headache. Oh, Dan, you had a headache earlier. Yeah. It's 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 actually like the the, the vision part is good now. I can I can like see everything. But like I have a bit of a headache, but it's fine. It's nothing. I'm just forcing myself it, to eat. NBD bro. Because I'm worried that if I don't, I will uh it'll be bad. And fall you'll fall asleep. I mean I'm probably gonna fall asleep anyway, because like people eat I mean sleep. <laughs> they do both of those. Sarah San resubscribes for two months. Thank you, Saracen. Seven months for Jolteon Ultra. Um, hey. Since you've been to Japan twice, do you understand a little Japanese now? No. No. I mean, Dan, you've been once. Yeah. And do you... I, I, I still only know, like, two or three phrases, and that's it. So, But I mean, they both get you really far, which is, hello, and thank you. Is that is that the the two things you know is hello and thank you and that's it. Uh -huh. That is, that's it's really all you have to have. That's it's probably bare minimum. Maybe, yeah, maybe, maybe like where's the toilet room, please. And I don't know any grammatical things, so it's just words. It's like toy day, which is just someone walking into the room and screaming toilet <laughs> until someone understands what you mean. But like also, generally you can speak. English phrases and they just understood. You'd yeah, be like, yeah, yeah. bathroom, toilet, where where can I use the bathroom? Where is wash closet? Because they call it wash closet. Oh, really? Oh, WC. Yeah, like every, everywhere in the world, but America calls <laughs> yeah. it like wash closet. Yeah. And it's, I think it's weird. I think it's a weird phrase. Wash I think, closet? I, I think it'd be fun if there was a shower where it was a closet. Like. I mean, showers are basically wet closets. They're the size of closets. Yeah. yeah. That's why it's called wash closet. But, but 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 what if it was literally like this like 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 your pant Okay, what what if your pantry like you open the doors and it was just the shower? It was just it was just the I mean, I would call it a shower. Would you call it a wash closet? Then? I mean, no, it's it would be a wash pantry. It's completely different. <laughs> WP. It's not even the same thing. WP. Seven months also for 98% peach. Bread! Bread. I still got a little left. I'm working on it. Seven months from Coffee Cats. Here's to seven months and many more crazy things to happen on Breakfast Stream. I'm looking forward to more craziness. Dan being here, does that count as crazy? A little bit. It's different. Yeah. Crazy things are different, so it's like... I'm crazy. <laughs> Dan's crazy! <laughs> Two months from Casadicia. Oh, yeah, I get to finally join one of these. Too bad the reason is that I'm sick. Nice to see Dan. Aww. Well, get well soon. I mean, I'm glad that you can at least tune in, and hopefully we bring, like, some level of j joy to your illness. You know, like, you feel better. Yeah. Not joy, we joy to the illness, but joy... <laughs> joy to the illness! <laughs> All the bacteria and viruses! Joy to the sickness down oh. inside your lungs! I thought you were doing joy to the world. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> No, I was doing Jeremiah with the Bullfrog. Like, that, that also got be... subs from uh, Soifua, Multac32, seven months for D-Scoot, three months for Taco Bell Chihuahua, which is appropriate because there was a Taco Bell alert today. Yay. Congrats on the plus. Six months from Halberdier V2, resubbing manually since prime subs are annoying. Also, school's almost out. Plenty studying and packing. Yay. What month is it? Oh, yeah, we're, it's almost to May. Oh, like, no, no offense to, like, anyone that's in school, but the minute that I graduated, I forgot school existed for all ages. Yeah. Like, I don't remember that school was a thing. And sometimes... I, I, I just think of high school. I don't really think about college. Do you ever see a school bus and think, oh, yeah. That yeah, happens they're, to they're, me and Mal all the time. We see yeah. a school bus and we're like, oh, that's right, children. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I see a school bus and I'm like, oh, crap. I'm going to be stuck for like an hour behind this bus. I just, um, I, I think it's because we work from home and we're always here during the times that like school picks up and lets out. 
Yeah. So when, on the on the the few occasions where all of a sudden we see a school bus, we're like, oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> There's children. Children exist. I forgot. <laughs> there they are. Children are being are done educated for today. <laughs> You got six months from Clockwork Clementine. Been a while since I could catch the stream and resub, but I'm glad I could catch it today. And Clockwork, thank you for being here. And congrats on Double Plus. Just got through the notifications. I don't know if Chaz has already run it, but he said he wanted me to hit the button, so I'm gonna hit the Patreon ticker. And it's updated, which I think is the most important thing. Um, and thanks to everybody who Patreons. <laughs> Um, thanks, thanks to the Patreons for Patreoning. We appreciate your patronage over on Patreon.com. If you'd like to be a patron on Patreon for our Patreon, feel free to go over to Patreon.com slash Stephen George to learn more about how you can be a patron on Patreon.com. Yep. Yep. And I, I did. I, I, I got the thing updated, which was which was important. It's so neat. It's, it's neat. Chaz did it. It's neat. Chaz did it is something they'll put on my, my tombstone, I'm sure. I think I, I think I'm sit, I'm slightly in front because I was looking and I've realized you're in focus and I'm slightly out of focus. I just realized that. Now that the stream's almost over. There, I think that's better. Maybe I don't know. It doesn't matter. It's fine. It's, all good. it's fine. I should probably eat this bread. So damn, what are you uh, what are you up to today? Oh, also, how's uh. your toast? Uh, it, was, it was great. Sorry, I didn't. I didn't eat all of it. Um, I'll eat it on the way home. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm just. I'm just so full. I don't. I don't. Because I also don't normally eat breakfast that much. Um, yeah. Cool. Thank you. Um, Chess says, "How many times is my name on your tombstone?" A few. Uh, <laughs> What would I ask you? I forgot. Um, about oh, my what, what, my what are you doing today? No, what are you oh, doing? Um, well, I'm gonna. I'm, I think I'm. I think I'm gonna pack. Um, I mean, I'm. Oh yeah, you're leaving. Yeah, yeah. I'm. I'm actually leaving because. I uh, forgot. Yeah. So, so what's funny is that Mal's grandma's birthday is on Saturday. And she's um, turning ninety. Yeah, and and my and my uncle's birthday. Oh. It's a surprise. And he's turning so 60, don't, right? Don't tell him. Yeah, yeah, he's turning 60. So, um... That's so weird. Yeah, so... Because Mal and Dan share a birthday. And yeah. your relatives share a birthday. Yeah. Um, I don't like this at all. Something is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Some, something um, is very strange. Yeah, and actually, my, my grandma and I, um, when, when she was around... Um, we shared a birthday too, so like. Really? Yeah. So it's weird that like. Yeah. Wow. So anyway, um, yeah. So so I'm I'm gonna be packing today. Uh, also, I haven't mowed uh, the the grass in like. We gosh no like months because like we haven't needed to until. Really? Oh well, yeah. Yeah, because, yeah, because like the the grass has winter. died. Um, so it's like super tall, so. Well. I'm gonna be doing that, so. Anyway. Um, Sorry, I was choking on bread. How was your bread, by the way? Oh, it's great. Um, what kind it's of bread like, is it? It's like a uh, we weedy, weedy bread. Oh, it's weedy. It's weedy wheat. If that was, if they could legally call it that, they'd call it weedy wheat. But also. Weedy, weedy. I think the bigger thing <clears throat> is that it's been in the freezer for like two months. And it was like cooked from the freezer. Like I took it out from the freezer where it's like covered in ice. Cooked from the freezer? And then put it in the toaster and hit the defrost setting. So like it tastes frozen a little yeah. bit. And like you just you just have to cover it with enough something to make it okay. Basically. 300 bits from Taco Bell Chihuahua. Steven, I saw your vlog from March 2018 about demonetization. Is demonetization still a problem for you now? Um, right now, it's not that bad. Um, it For a while, it, for a while, everything was fine. And then there was like... Yeah, should I be worried or is... Adpocalypse? Which one? The first one? I don't know. Things happened and it was like, oh crap. And then... Things got better, and then I think the second one was the Logan Paul thing, or the third one. 
I don't know. It's it's like <clears throat> it seems like every few months something happens. Like some YouTuber does something terrible or stupid mm -hmm. to make advertisers well, leave. Prob probably every day. But... Well, yeah, every day. It's just if they're big enough that you know Wall Street Journal notices or whatever. Yeah. Um, and when that happens, that's that tends to be when things happen. What what affects us specifically is like YouTube wants to, I guess, be proactive, and they're like tweaking the system, and that's when weird stuff happens. Yeah. Like there was um. A good example was a few months back, there was um, a whole thing with people making videos that were kind of like aimed at kids, but they weren't kid friendly. Like they were like really bizarre, weird crap. Yeah. And then at the same time that was happening, there was a whole thing about people going to videos of children that were not necessarily explicit videos, but would contain parts that were like, if out of context, could be misconstrued as like, I don't know, like vague child pornography type thing. Like children, like young kids in swimsuits type thing. So there were people that were going to these videos and were leaving timestamps for like those moments. So there was like this whole subculture of people going to videos and sharing like this vague child pornography type stuff. Anyway, when that happened, YouTube uh, like flew in to do stuff with algorithms. And yeah. I remember thinking like, that's good, but also it probably won't affect us because like we don't, we don't have children in our videos, <laughs> yeah. right? Anyway, it was like the, it was like a day or two later, there was a vlog that we released that uh, Lily was in. Yeah. Uh, Austin and Nikki's um, kid, daughter, and I'm I'm pretty sure there's no mention in the description or the tags or anything about like child or children or any of that stuff. But that video was demonetized, and it blew my mind because there's some sort of crazy work behind the scenes like where it can detect. I don't know where it can detect like there is a child in this video and I was did, like did, did you ever say like what? baby baby or child or like I don't know and I mean that's that's another thing is that it can read um, the auto generated subtitle the captions yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. where like it makes its own captions based on what it hears and then it has that as text and then it checks against that text so maybe you know maybe we're like oh Lily's getting so big and is a child and YouTube was like child beep, 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 beep. Wow. And it's it's not a problem in those instances because like you can you can request that it be reviewed. Yeah. So I did that. Um, the the only downside is like when you have already made a video public and something like that happens, and then there's a period of lost revenue because yeah. it's just already people are already watching it. Yeah. And there's if there's if it's been demonetized and people watch it, you can't be like, okay, we got it fixed. Can everyone go back and watch it again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. But yeah, honestly, um, it's not been that that terrible lately. I mean, for as all the for as many problems as YouTube has had, they have solved a lot of them. And I know that they get a bad rep, but like, they're fixing stuff, you know, the best they yeah. can. Yeah. Um. Some something that um Nikki said was that like Lily will be like watching something, mm -hmm. like like on like the YouTube Kids app or whatever. But it's like. Next, or it's, it's like trailer for Saul, like before, like a video or whatever. That's, that's and she's a, like, yeah. why? <laughs> what? That's a very, like, that's a very interesting problem to solve because, like, it seems like an pe people, easy one to to do. Well, it's it's like, one of those things like advertise when if you want to put an advertisement before video, like YouTube can't check them all, which is a like. It's one of those things that it sounds insane, but also like there's too there's too many. Like there's not enough people to actually like manually check that stuff. So that sort of thing can happen where uh, trailers for horror movies that contain imagery that is scary or profanity or, or sexualized content can actually appear before content that is explicitly for children. Yeah. And it's like, no, you can't do that. But yeah. you know, at, these are all like really hard problems to solve. So, yeah, it's one of those things that I'm just glad I don't have to deal with that. Yeah. Where I'm not the person at YouTube that's like has to figure out how to make all of this stuff work because there's a million moving parts. I'm glad that my job is like film the cat. 
Good. I can do that. We're, I, can, we're done. I don't have to film That's today. anything else. Yeah. Anyway. Um, all right. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and end it here. We went a little bit long, but not as long as Tuesday. Yeah. Um, Dan, thanks for being here. Thanks for letting me um, come over and uh, invite myself. <laughs> No problem. Uh, and uh, also, uh, you should plug your uh, podcast because people may not oh, know that Dan Dan does oh. a podcast. You've been doing it for how long now? Um, since November. Yes, like since November. So like we're like seven months we're, almost. Uh, yeah. We're, Over we're, half a year. Yeah, it's it's pretty crazy. Um, go check out um, Passing Time with Will and Dan. Um, they can watch it's, it on YouTube. Yeah, it, well, yeah, watch yeah, it. It's, it's, it's actually, an audio podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's an audio podcast. We, we, um, so you can just do youtube.com slash passing timecast. Um, or you can search for it on like on, iTunes on and... Stitcher or iTunes or um, Spotify. Spotify. Also. So, yeah. yeah. It's cool. It's like, a, it's like a short form, very laid back casual thing with um, Dan and Will. Yeah. They're usually like 25 minutes long. Yeah, and, and we've we've had uh, guests like Alex and Steven. You yeah, were, I was on. I was you, on. One you of them. were nice enough to to be on there. I would um, come back. I would come back. It was uh, fun. Yeah, yeah. I'll um, come back. Yeah. So uh, check so check that out if you haven't already, and um, I'll, I'll come back and do another one at some point. Oh, that'd be that'd fun. Be, that'd be fun. All right, everyone. Uh, that is it for today. I hope you have a wonderful yeah. um, Thursday. I am going to go. I've been up since four. I'm starting to get a little tired, which is understandable, I guess. Um, I I assume you're not going to take a nap today. I mean, I say a lot of things, but I don't know. Like, you you tell yourself, like, I'm not going to take a nap. Yeah, yeah, not to take. But the thing is, four p.m. is going to roll around, and I'm I'm I don't know if I'm going to make it. Yeah. So I'm either going to have to nap or I'm going to like go to bed real early or something. But um, four one. April 1st vlog will be out today, and if I can get it done in time, April 2nd will be done and out with it. So we'll we'll see. We'll hope for the best. Anyway, thanks for watching. Yay. See you guys uh, Tuesday at 9 a.m. Eastern for more Breakfast, Breakfast Stream. Breakfast Stream.